Hey there, today I'm going to show you how to download data from RoboFlow in Python. So in this Python notebook here, the first thing we've done is we've pip installed RoboFlow. And then we've also imported RoboFlow here. And then we're going to define our RoboFlow object here with our API key to authenticate. And then we're going to choose the project that we want to download from. And then we're going to choose the version. And then we can set a location where we want our data set to download uh, in, in the format that we, we are seeking. So now you might be wondering, where do we get these parameters? So when you're in the RoboFlow app, let's imagine you've created a new account. And then you've created that account uh, and set the workspace that you're working in to public. So then you can export your data for free. Uh, after that, you can upload your data here. And you can upload annotations and images. You could also upload just images and then make your own annotations within RoboFlow. After that, you go to your dataset tab and you generate a new version. And when you generate that version, you can choose pre-processing and augmentation steps. Uh, after you've chosen those, uh, you can go here to export and then export your data in the format that you want. And you'll get a snippet from here of uh, the Python code to paste back in. Now, um, we haven't quite pushed that yet, so I'll have to find my API key um, on my own in my account here. So I can go up here to my settings and then your workspace. And then you can go to your RoboFlow API and you can always find your RoboFlow API key here. And so I'll go ahead and find that. And I'll take that over to the notebook to authenticate. And then also for the project, you can go here and you can find the project up here and with your version up here. Um, also, these will, will be auto-populated in the future. So you choose your project. And then you choose your version, which is 1. And then we're going to download this into content backslash my data sets. So we'll download this data set here. And we chose the format of YOLO E5. So now we can go ahead and go into my data sets and see that our data set downloaded here. Uh, we can check out uh, our test image here. We can check out our training images. Um, and then also your labels all come down here as well. Um, and those will come down in the format that you need uh, for the destination you need for uh, training. And we hope you enjoyed this video. And uh, we'll see you in the next one.